Hey everybody, I'm Dan Joseph with the Media Research Center. We are at a global warming rally. It is 30 degrees, it is cold, there's some snow coming down. I couldn't make this stuff up if I tried. We're gonna ask people what they think of the recent sale of current TV, Al Gore's network, to Al Jazeera, which is basically funded by oil money, and whether people have a problem with that. You were recently about the little controversy surrounding Al Gore and the sale of current TV. Yes, I did, yeah. To, to uh, Actually, oil caught that. interest? Yes, I caught that. What do you think about that? Yeah. Do you feel a little betrayed by him? Well, I guess it's kind of a paradox for me. <laughs> what do you think of Al Gore's <laughs> recent sale of uh, current TV to Al Jazeera? I, I don't really know about that. I, you don't? What do you think about Al Gore and his recent sale of uh, current TV to Al Jazeera? I don't know anything about that. Oh, you haven't heard about that? No. You just heard about what Al, what Al Gore did recently, selling his TV station to, to Al Jazeera? I heard about this. You heard about this. Did you hear about this? Yes, yes. What do you guys think about that? Is, isn't that making him a little bit of a hypocrite? Being how, Not at all. Have you heard recently about Al Gore selling current TV to Al Jazeera? You didn't hear about that. Are you a little disappointed with Al Gore recently? Um, I haven't been following Al Gore recently. Did you know he sold current TV? You know what? I, I've not been following that at all. Do you think that's hypocritical in any way, given his history of climate I, change I heard, activism? I heard that, but I don't know enough about the issue to really oh, comment okay. on it. Even though it's... The company he sold it to is funneled by oil money? Yeah, but they do also cover a lot of the news that most of our local channels don't because we're, you know, our, we only have four corporations basically owning all of our media. And uh, Al Jazeera actually does, does tell news about the world. My understanding is that Al Jazeera will be running. Um, and the uh, network, is that right? I, I don't know. Al Jazeera had one of the best records on climate news. If you can take the money and not, um, and not slant their direction, I think, why not? <laughs> he sold his TV station to a government that funds a TV station with oil money. Does that upset you at all? I didn't, I didn't know that. I, I don't have an opinion. Okay, on okay, that, no, no, I don't, no, no. I don't have any, I've not it any seems like a lot that. of people don't don't know about that. Isn't it a little cold for a global warming rally today? Yeah, and you know what? That's. Uh, <laughs> well, you can't confuse uh, temperature or weather with climate change. Two different things. People. Is that why they changed we the name from global warming to climate change? Well, I don't know about that, but have you have you have weather day to day, but you have climate change, so you have to look at the science. You have to look at the statistics. This is actually pretty normal, though, for a February in Washington. Yeah, but you know, there's no. We we've had um, we're from Massachusetts. Okay, and, well, yeah, um, yes. So we've had very little snow. We were basically in a drought in Massachusetts. Oh, really? Even though we did well, have yeah, one big storm on the other day. Yeah, we got one big storm, but before that, there was nothing. Nothing. You know? And usually, we have a lot. We left the global warming rally early because it was too cold. Right? It's too cold for global warming rally. <laughs> Having in August.